Come along, children. Now we're going to have a little music, like old time. Yeah, I want it, and they need it. I stay on it, it's no secret. Hey guys, Justin Pickett with Geek and Gasoline. We're here at IFTD 2019. We're here with our buddy Simon Gosworth at the Rio booth. Nice How's to it see going, you. Man? Good to see you. So we got a couple new lines to go over for this year. Yeah, awesome. yeah, we're pretty excited with what we got at Rio for, for 20, 2020, next year's stuff, right? right? Yeah. So we got um, some trout lines, which I'm really pretty excited about. Did a lot of testing them. Uh, Probably our favorite one's a technical trout. Okay. And cool. as the name suggests, it's a line designed for technical feeders, right? You're fishing long leaders, right. dry flies at distance, Absolutely. precision casting. So that we have a line that's called the technical trout. Good deal. And it's for technical trout. Technical fishing. Or Beautiful. did some testing down in New Zealand. Yeah. Yes. Somebody had awesome. to go down there, right? And test I mean, it out. Somebody's got to do it. The poor, <laughs> yeah. poor smug that had to go down yeah, there. Yeah, it was pretty awesome. <laughs> um, and they're, you know, they're like 16, 18, 20 foot leaders. And you've got to have Absolutely. a lot of taper and a lot of mass at the front end to create to turn over those long leaders absolutely but you don't want too much mass because you're presenting right. a fly so that's what the technical trout is if you're a dry fly angler if you like long leaders if you want to have these soft presentation casts then that's what the technical trout line is awesome uh, and that's available as a double taper or a weight forward three to six you know standard trout sizes Perfect. Awesome. Uh, and then it's also you know for those who like the low stretch versions like myself then it's in that black series our in touch version just ultra low stretch and same yeah. taper, right? Same coloring, awesome. uh, just onto the coloring, right? The front end is blue, so yep. it's pretty cool against a blue or a gray sky. Yep. It's, yep. it's lost in there, so it doesn't scare a lot of fish. Absolutely. It's got a nice little orange section here, which is a good visual for your casting yeah. range. It's about 20 feet to the orange. Okay, perfect. So it's yeah, kind of a nice, you got a good, little feel for distance. No, kind of uh, takes the guesswork out a little bit. Yeah, it or, does. Yeah. It does, exactly. Especially when you get guides saying, you want to make a 20 foot cast or 25 yeah, foot cast. No question, you've got to you measure got it, on that. Yeah. So that's our technical trout. And this awesome. is the line, as I say, we've been fishing about a year now. And this line is just so, so it's nice. Really awesome. It is awesome. So if you'd good like deal. dries, that is on your shopping list. Absolutely. What else we got over here? You guys have been messing with your sinking lines a little bit. This we year, have too, actually, yeah. So, you know, I'm from the UK and I mean, back in the UK, we fish a lot of lakes, a lot, we of, a lot of lake fishing, sinking lines are getting down. And so yeah. we've really tweaked our sinking line series this year with a lot of feedback from our UK boys out there. And, awesome. Um, one of the main things people are asking for is, can you make it easy to identify different sink rates of lines? Sure. Right? At the moment, most sinking lines are charcoal -y gray or a black. Yeah, and then and, the running lines are all a uh, myriad yeah. of colors. And, and you know, like my, like, I have no idea what's on my reels half the time. That's I what think I know, are, but I don't right? really know until yeah. I get out there. And you think, oh, maybe you have a label. Some people don't put the label on and you yeah. all have all these black sinking lines. Right. So this is, a, this is our uh, Fathom series. Okay. And this is a sink free. So all sink threes will have, for example, this blue running line. Okay, cool. Just as a color identifier. All sink fives will have this burgundy maroon color, right? So you can tell immediately from the color of the running line what sink rate it is. So that's, that's pretty cool. You don't have to stick a label on. Uh -huh. They've got fairly short heads around 30, 35 foot because you know, any lake angler is going to strip the fly in close. Yep. And the last thing you want is a long head that's going to take five or six casts to get exactly. back out again. You want to be able to pick it up yeah. and shoot and go again. Uh, so that's our main change on our, our deep series, which was our previous Sinky series, is this color running line. We've all got welded loops to attach the leaders on. But the coolest awesome. line in that series, we call it the Fathom Clean Sweep. Yes. And this is a sweep line. Yeah. You know what a sweep line's I all love about. sweep lines. So sweep lines, for those of you who don't know what a sweep line is, sweep lines are lines that sink in a big U shape, right? Yep. And they, so they've got to cover yes. more of the water column. Yeah, right. Your line, fly lands and you strip, pulls it down, sweeps it around, pulls it up, so you cover a whole depth range yeah. rather than fishing yeah. at a single depth. And actually, a lot of times we'd use that just kind of as to be able to dial in on our other sink lines yeah. and stuff like that too. You kind of figure out where, where the they're fish eating are. in that water column. Yeah, exactly. And you can kind of dial in on another line. Yep, once you've found the, water, the depth that is. presentation, anything. So the, the clean sweep lines, they have we've all got an intermediate front end, so that's your slow sinking. Yep. And then this one's got a sink six next right section so that really pulls it down yep. and then the running line sink four so that holds awesome. it up so you've got this beautiful sweep through yes. the water yeah they're super cool to fish super cool and then we have a hang marker right as all our lines have a little 20 foot hang marker yep. so if you're really one of these still water geeks into still water yeah. fishing and you fish the hang and do all this stuff yep. everything is in this little clean sweep line that's awesome there's a lot of thought into that that's really cool yeah so that's not many people go into that because people don't know the sweep lines in the yeah, US as much little, as Europe. Yeah, you don't get as much still water and you don't, especially the technical aspects of still water yeah. here, but I know the guys out in the UK and in Europe, they're, they're into oh, that they're all, they are they're so all about it. it. All about it. Well, that's really cool. So that's it. Those are our core 
Freshwater new entries for next year. Awesome, man. Yeah. Well, I really appreciate your time, man. Thanks for Thank going over for all this stuff. Thank you for coming by. Guys, check it. out all the new lines from Rio. Tune in to Ginkgo Gasoline for more from ITD 2019.